Go, go. Yo, what's good, YouTube? Me, y'all tune in to Get Hip TV. As y'all can see from the title, we got Blueface and Anneli Chopper going at it. So, man, I'm gonna break that situation down, then I'm gonna let y'all hear what they both had to say. So, man, stay tuned for all that. But before we get into the video, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay up to whenever I post. But all right, y'all, let's get into it. So, man, if y'all are not here, Blueface and Ennin Lee Chopper been going at it. It all started over them going back and forth online to Blueface dissing Ennin Lee in the song to Ennin Lee then calling Blueface out to box. Ennin Lee tweeted Blueface saying, Let's box. Who can set up celebrity boxing match in Vegas? Me and him hit me ASAP. He undefeated versus women. I don't respect the that put his hands on him anyway. Blueface responded, Finally, we got one. And shortly after that, a flyer was made, but it only led to more drama, so both of them had something to say and spoke out about it. So, man, I'm gonna roll the clips and I'm gonna let y'all see it. Pressured up right now, cuz I'm done with you rap niggas after today. All you niggas is bitches, all you niggas is marks, all you niggas is scary. I don't ask why, like, my bitch should run a fade with me before any of you rap niggas, and that's crazy. That's crazy, like. I already see in the league at Kofi, he talked to his mommy. His mommy was like, I don't think it's a good idea. And he was probably like, yeah, you're right. I kind of got my ass kicked on camera about three or four times already. I don't think I should publicize it and make it a thing. So let me, this nigga talking about negotiation. Nigga, it's time to squabble up. Nigga, you talking about a negotiation? Nigga, what you want, a Honda Civic? Nigga, what you, we got whatever is to be negotiated, but we know what that means. You're finna outprice yourself. You're finna do all this relevant. I, I need this, you don't. But you asked for it. No sense. Just say you don't wanna squabble up. I, I would <laughs> I can't believe this, cuz. Cuz you could already see niggas' energy when shit get put together, cuz. You could already see it. And I could see it. Cuz don't wanna squabble. Like, Like, these niggas are so boof, like, cuz. Imagine me popping it to a nigga online, like, nigga, yeah, I'm, I, nigga, anybody that can set it up, nigga, set it up, let's do it. Then the nigga start putting shit in motion, and you like, well, wait, I didn't negotiate my terms of the deal. Like, what? Cuz, you know everything is gonna be contracted and written up. The, the, the flyer you posted, and you talking about negotiations? Like, that sound like some peace treaty shit, like some some water down. Like, what do you want, cuz? Are we squabbling or not? Dead homies, like, bro, you niggas is pissing me off. I'm finna go, I'm finna go run a fade, like, outside. That's my fault for getting worked up, though, cuz. That's my fault. You know why it's my fault? Cuz this nigga's a Muslim, a vegan, and a crip. So it's like a nigga like that, he don't even know himself for real, cuz he don't even know, like, that don't even make sense, cuz. Like, Nigga, you eat paninis and tofu and shit, like. <laughs> like, come on, cuz, like, I'm really. <laughs> oh, that's why. Oh, crap, bro. You niggas really, like, oh my god. Like, I, I never let the beef get cold, and that's why I eat. <sighs> Man, you the type of nigga that eat with your eyes closed. I can tell. Type of nigga, Muslim, vegan, and a crip. <laughs> Who's gonna tell them that you can't be like all three of those at the same time and not be looked at as like a booth individual to a real, <laughs> a real, yeah. I'm looking at you like, bro. Bro, this man funny as hell. I wasn't even finna respond to you, but I'm gonna respond to you, cuz. What you ain't finna do is make me look like I'm a I'm gonna hold and bag now to fight this, fight that. I tell Blueface under his post, cuz he posted a fake flyer. That has not been approved by nothing with a whole website on it. So I'm like, I'm like, how, how is it? I asked you to fight. How the f you get a flyer the next day with me and your face on it? And I, I'm the one that asked you to fight. So now it's like you want some clout chasing shit. This one people. So I come in on the job. I'm like, I'm like, damn, bro. I'm like, you posting a flyer and we ain't negotiating nothing. He says, oh, you say that? 
You don't want to fight and you getting cold feet, you bagging out the fight and want to manipulate the whole situation. No, nigga, I'm just saying, why is you posting my face on a flyer with a whole website? You you making no money out of real because people clicking and going to that website looking for this a pre-order or something and not even finding it. So you false advertising. Know what I'm saying? Then, cause it, let's, let's call the elephant in the room. The elephant in the room is you've been boxing three, four years. So you already got three, four years of experience as boxing. Now I ain't gonna say as a fighter, but as a boxer. You know what I'm saying? You trying to rush me in a ring when, when I ain't got nowhere near the experience, not even a, a month, not even three weeks, two weeks of boxing experience. You trying to rush me in a ring so you can have the ups. Come on now, I'm not a scared nigga, but I ain't no dumb nigga. I know this shit, I still gotta learn you this month. You know what I'm saying? I know this shit. I know this shit. I still gotta learn before I even step foot in it. I gotta know what you know. You know what I'm saying? So you trying to rush me in the ring? You trying to post a fake flyer? You trying to do? I always to say that I'm a hoe when I'm scared and I got cold feet. Come on, man. Don't, don't even manipulate the situation like that. Let your deal, man. I don't hit your phone. Try to hit you personally. You don't want to hit me personally. You want to do everything on the internet. How we gonna get something done to even get in the ring for real? So do I want to fight you? Honestly, I don't want to fight you no more because at this point, you just look, it's like a cloud chase, desperate thing for you. And I really stooped low in the beginning because I shouldn't even been talking to you because anyway, who are you now, bro? Like, you need shit like this to stay relevant, to make money. You need people like me to feed into you. So this is my last video. It's my last time saying something. If we want to jack, let's set it up properly. Give me months to train. Let me do this shit the right way. Don't try to rush me in no fight for no clout. And say that I'm pulling out a fight because I'm telling I'm I'm calling yo yo bluff nigga. Do you wanna fight, nigga? Do you really wanna fight? You posting a fake flyer and shit from the Muslim vegan crib. Not even Muslim. Crazy man. <laughs> man, look, bro. Believe what y'all want, bro. I don't, I called you out. You know what I'm saying? In my last video, bro. I'm done talking, bro. I'm done. I'm finished for Nico, bro. Leave me alone, please. I want to I wanna leave the circus, man. Get me at your circus. Leave me alone. All right, man. So as y'all heard from that, Blueface felt like NLE ducking because he wasn't on board when the flyer was made and put out. But NLE saying that he not ducking since he was the one that called Blueface out to begin with. But NLE feels like Blueface doing it all for clout and trying to rush everything and not do it on agreed terms. So, man, I want to get y'all thoughts and opinions on all this. Do y'all think they actually going to make this boxing match happen? And if they do, who y'all got winning? Let me know down in the comment section below. And if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure y'all smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, and hit that notification bell to stay hip to whenever I post. Until next time, we out.